has been unraveling the phrase. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into a very interesting phrase in the English language, has been. This term is loaded with cultural context and is used quite frequently. Let's understand its meaning and usage. At its core, has been, is a combination of the verb, has, and the past participle, been. But when used together as a noun, it takes on a whole new meaning. Has been, refers to a person, especially in the entertainment or sports industry, who was once famous, influential, or effective in their field, but is no longer regarded as such. It's essential to see how, has been, is applied in real-life contexts. Here are a few examples. 1. The pop singer, once at the height of his career, is now considered a has-been. 2. Many think he's a has-been, but I believe he still has a lot to offer. Remember, when you use, has-been, to describe someone, it can come off as dismissive or derogatory. It's important to be aware of the context and the feelings of the person being referred to. Understanding synonyms can help solidify a word's meaning. Some synonyms or related terms for has been include washed up, outdated, faded star. However, keep in mind that while these terms can sometimes be used interchangeably, the nuances might differ based on context. So there you have it, a deep dive into the phrase, has been. English is filled with such colorful and context-rich phrases. We hope this video shed light on this particular term. Keep exploring the language, and remember, the journey of learning never ends. See you in the next video.